Uh, all right, today is part three of our uh, laparoscopic uh, insemination. And today is the fun part. We're actually going to show you the breeding. Um, we have Dr. Wiley as well as her team from Iowa State University Vet Med Field Services. Um, I also got my vet class out with me. And so as we go through here, she's going to explain what she's doing. But before we shot this video, we did sedate the goats. Um, we do have them properly restrained. So when we cut to the goat, that is what you're going to see. Um, so with that, we'll go to the procedure. Okay, so I clip this, all right, um, we numb the skin with lidocaine and then we'll open up the artroparasite. Gonna inflate the abdomen with air to help expand it so we can visualize the uterus better. Place our choke cars. Okay. Into the abdomen we go. There's her bladder. We're aiming caudally. Right, and there's her uterus. This is omentum, some rumen. Right, so we'll take our aspect needle in. Let's get quarter cc of semen. Here's a uterine horn to find the greater curvature. Inject. There's one quarter ml of semen. And then we will take your, lay her back out. We let some of the air out. I don't get a heroic effort to let all the air out. It'll give us more over time. And we suture the incision sites. Maybe. And that's it. All right, so once again, this is part three of our laparoscopic insemination. If this is the first video you've watched, I encourage you to go back to part one and part two. We had an eight day estrus synchronization protocol. Uh, you saw the fun part at the end, but there are a few days that led up to this. Uh, thanks again for watching.